Welcome back, everybody, to Ultimate CNFT. Mike, aka Mr. Ultimate, here with you today, and we're talking about the Royal Chess Club. Now, I've got a lot of information to share with you about this project because we're not just talking about a project. We're pretty much talking about an entire, almost kind of like an ecosystem to uh, maintain this project, playing chess, but in unique and different ways, working with some really, really cool NFTs. There's a bunch of stuff with this project. I've talked to Incognito, the founder, at depth. Of course, Johnny Tran and I have become very good friends. Shout out to both of you guys. You guys are both amazing. I love what you're doing in this space. This is a great team. This is a great idea. This project is gonna be, have to be broken down in more than one video. I would also love to have Incognito and Johnny Tran and whoever else from the team would like to be on for a team interview somewhere down the road because this is one of those very, very, very in-depth projects. We're going to break down as much as we possibly can. Remember, this is going to be the first video of many to come, but right now we're going to be breaking down this first coming up mint and you need to know and you need to see the upgrades to these cards because what we're looking at with the white paper and the website doesn't quite show the newness and the upgrades of what we're working we're talking about quality here so what is royal chess club we've got 1703 members uh the date for this mint this is going to be for the membership club mint now there's only 1000 of these guys and the price is only 45 ada so let's there's your times right there there's everything you need to know we're not going to spend too much time on the discord i've got other stuff up to show you but what i do want to show you what are you minting right now for 45 ada let's just take a look at it because this has been royally i guess you could say upgraded look at that look at the detail yeah that's sick that's the bronze. We've got bronze, we've got silver, we've got gold. Uh, I'm getting three of these guys. Again, donated to the channel for the tier three paid subscription membership members. I hope I get my hands on a gold. I've actually seen the gold. I got to see it privately. I can't share it with you because it's not here on the Discord yet, but you guys will be getting to see it in a couple of days. Uh, you're gonna wanna follow this project. You're gonna wanna follow the Discord, follow the Twitter. Of course, I'll put all the links below and you're gonna wanna jump on my Discord as well. Johnny Tran is very active in there. I'd love to see what he's doing. OG in the space now coming out partially. Uh, as a founder with his own project, working with Incognito, who's everywhere. He's he's everything but Incognito. I love to see it, you guys. I'm very excited to feature this project on the channel. So just a few things here in this latest announcement. Um, to update what's going on with these cards, these membership cards. There are more royal uh, rarities now uh, for each the silver, the gold, and the bronze. You got the backboard has been basically upgraded. There's there's basically different tiers of these as well now. So here's a quick update. Mint prep is coming along. They've started the mint on the CNFT calendars, working on updated marketplace, and they have the policy ID ready. So this again is what we're minting. But let's deep dive a little bit more into the project. There's again your price, your supply, only a thousand of them. Now why are we going to wants to hang on to these mint passes. It's not simply to mint the project that's coming up. Again, this is a very big project. This is video one of what ultimately, ultimately will be three videos. Let's go jump in. What do we wanna do first? Let's go jump into the website first and then we'll go deep dive the white paper and then we'll bring it at you and I'll get this uploaded and you can check it out. Oh yeah, where the cream does arise to the top. Dig it. All right, let's go quickly through this website. I just, I really wanna show it to you because it's a very well done website and we get a chance to meet the team here a little bit. Most of the work we're gonna be doing is going to be on the light paper, but let's go ahead and jump into this again. This is the first part of a three part series because with each mint, I'm gonna to have to cover this project, but the first one being the passes, you gotta know what's going on. So welcome to the Royal Chess Club. There's a little bit about that. We're gonna read that actually on the white paper coming up, but I did wanna show you the difference between the membership card that you see right here, as opposed to the one we just showed on the Discord. You can see that this just, even though it's cool, just wasn't good enough for our boys creating this wonderful project, right? They had to step it up and they had to make things better and I love to see it. So we know they got the bronze, the silver, and the gold. You can claim the OG status by owning a membership card. I know there's a special role you can have for owning one of each too. So I don't know what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get in three of them, but I'm gonna buy myself a couple of these and I'm probably gonna try and stack. And you know, I love to have those roles and I like to maximize. If I'm gonna be into a project, I wanna maximize the benefits. But there's a little bit here about the art. Um, now again, there's three different mints. We'll talk a little bit more about that here in a few minutes and on future updates, but check out the art. This is like renditions, right? What you see on the thumbnail uh, is a representation of the king. That's what the, your, their, uh, the NFTs are actually gonna look like. And I think they've done a really good job on the art. So there's all six of them. 
most of you who are watching this probably know more about chess than I do. Uh, I'm, I'm not. I've played a couple times in my life, and uh, I didn't really find it interesting. Of course, I traveled when I was a kid, but now we've got a project that's bringing it to Cardano. Check, and we're bringing it in the form of an NFT. Check, and an interactive game where I can earn, play to earn, and we can get chess tokens. Check, boom, I, I'm in. I mean, this 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 idea has now pulled me into understanding and wanting to know how to play chess. Now, to me, that speaks volumes because now. I see that this is onto something. Let's continue on. Let's catch up with the roadmap here. We are pretty much just past right around here, the membership card and the chess NFT artwork for quarter three, 2022. So quarter four, which is right around where we're at, the chess NFT mint and introducing the chess token and the tokenomics. Um, later on, and this is going to be in quarter one of 2023, you got the token airdrop and the play to earn development. So this is, there's a big play to earn aspect of this, and you'll see how that continues on as we continue on through this. So, you know, if you can check out the rest of this roadmap for yourself, always do your own research, ask questions. You guys, there's plenty of places to find out those answers. Uh, I'm just some guy on the internet. Always do your own research, but there's plenty of information. Always check out the lore too if you guys are interested in stuff like that. If you like to be a part of a community and part of a project, here's your chance to pause, pause, pause the video and read the lore. Let's continue on. It's a it's a really cool lore, actually, guys. It's it's actually it's it's really cool. I do think you should read it, but for the sake of the time on this video, we're not going to do it. We're going to skip the chess families right now because I'd rather show you that on the light paper. But if you dive into the chess verse with me for a minute here, let's check it out. Now, uh, you basically can be an intermediate, uh, you can be an expert, you can be a brand new, you know, new beginner just like me. Uh, like I said, I haven't played chess, but very interested in at this point. We're all welcome to play and earn at the Royal Chess Club. We've got you covered. Come and play and become a grandmaster. Do you know that the win of the game will be added as an attribute to your NFTs? That is really freaking cool. Thereby making it more valuable. Okay. All right. I'm listening. Scroll down for further details. Let's check it out. By the way, I would love again to get Incognito on here. He broke down, him and Johnny both actually, they broke down this project to me a couple weeks ago when I was first coming across it. And I was blown away with the amount of information and, and some of the things that I know that you all don't know yet, but you will know as you become more familiar with this project and that information becomes public. And that's what got me super excited. So uh, I can only do so much here in one video. So I would like the founders to come on here and tell you guys in their own words, the plans that they have. This is a big, big project. So the play to earn model, airdrop of the chess tokens, right? For delisted holders, of course, you can't have them listed. You can stake your NFTs, of course, to earn more chess. We're going to tell you what chess is in depth here in a few more minutes, but this is also non-custodial staking, guys, so you get to hold on to your NFTs in your wallet. Really cool. They're pretty much thinking of everything. So it's free to play. So to learn to play, so check it out. Pay, uh, I'm sorry, play for free with no investment required. Earn chess reward monthly or if you were in the top 100. Play to earn. Uh, Cover your game and rental fees. If you don't own NFTs and enter the game to play, win and earn. Percentage of each game, win goes back to the staked NFT families. Yes, we skipped the families here, but we're going to deep dive into those families and what they mean here in just a minute. Membership card holders, senior OGs. You have no rental fees for any game and also get a discount, uh, discounted uh, game fee. So if you're going to want to play the chess on this chess verse that they're basically creating, this is why we're minting those OG passes, one of the many reasons. But here are the guys, and we got Incognito, like I said, everything but Incognito. He's pretty much everywhere. Uh, I've come across him many times, and he's big into the apes as well. We got Cardano Kristoff, and we've got my good friend Johnny Tran, just a great dude, uh, head of sales and marketing CNFT enthusiast. Yes, he certainly is, and he's a tier three member uh, of my channel. So again, I appreciate you, Johnny. I love having you here, and I love seeing your project. We got a few more people. We got the sketch artist, the digital artist, and the mentor. And so there's a bunch of commonly asked questions you can check out, but now, it's time to jump in to the light paper and really start to break this down right now. All right, it's time for the nuts and bolts of Royal Chess Club. So let's check it out here. We'll skip the lore once again about the club. So the Royal Chess Club is the first of a kind Cardano chess NFT project. Yeah, there's no chess projects on Cardano, but we're building that one right now. Collection of dynamic characters of chess pieces. Our art will feature six base characters that capture the six different types. We all know what those types are. I don't even play chess that much, but even I know what they are. Our chess NFTs will belong to a chess family. This is the fun part I'm going to break down here for you guys. Chess NFTs are for access to exclusive chess verse. Now, 
check out these families. There's a little bit of history lesson here right there with you. So let's go check that out as well. Our chess NFT rarities are inspired by the evolution of the game across centuries, born out of the Indian game Chaturanga. During the 600s AD, the game eventually evolved by the 16th century into chess as we know it today. The chess NFTs will be ranked based on historical origin with the earliest being the rarest. Okay, so they're giving homage to the actual history of the game, which is really cool. So we got the Chaturanga, which is at the top of that pyramid. I'm not going to try and pronounce every single one of these because I'll probably slaughter them and I'll just spare your ears here. There's your third tier down and your fourth tier down. Now that's just the beginning of the breakdown. There's more to it. So chess family and perks again there's your breakdown and you got the mc card holders down here now what does that have to do how does this come into play i like the way they took this and they kind of made it to where some of the less rare nfts actually get you the biggest discounts in the game let's check that out so first of all you got the class multiplier we got the grandmaster the stake and rewards four times international and those ones are the two times and 1.5 times these are all staking to earn the chess token of course the master and the og boost staking now the chess I'm um, sorry, the class perks, Grandmaster, game fee discount, 5%. Cool. So there's going to be a gaming entire system. Right now, you can use, uh, I think it's chess.com, or I forget exactly what it is. I think it's in here somewhere. Uh, I remember looking at it a couple weeks ago. But uh, basically, they're going to be creating an entire platform where you're going to be really integrating. And the people who are really into chess, they're going to be, be like gung-ho about this because, again, this is the first one on Cardano, and I don't think anyone's going to be able to come around and compete with this because they're first to the punch, and they're doing it really, really well. Uh, the way they've laid out the design for me, it's like I have my mind wrapped around it, but I've got two more videos to really get you guys understanding what we're doing. This is just an overall fee, uh, an overall look into what it is. But So when you talk about these fees, you see how when it scales down in rarity, you get more discount for the games, which is really, really cool. So all the way down to the master the gaming fee discount for 20 percent and the uh master card holders an additional game discount so it's like you have this pyramid structure and you've got the rarities you've got the strength the families you got the staking rewards four times but then on the class perks it's like this full-on inverted pyramid thing where you get benefits both ways and i love that because we're looking at it at the eyes of a collector and somebody who really enjoys that so here are your membership cards again we've already seen the upgraded versions i've seen the gold one it is absolutely spectacular. Here are some staking rewards. Uh, I'm sorry, some boost staking rewards. Yes, by a little bit right there. The additional of the game discount is 15%, 10%, and 5%. So again, the discounts go up as the rarity goes down, which is really cool. So the chess art, remember I told you that's what the kings look like. This stud here on the on the uh, the thumbnail there. He's actually looking almost like some, some kind of Greek god, like some kind of Zeus looking character. Really cool how they took it. And they didn't do just traditional chess pieces. They took it and NFT sized it. I just made up that word. Yeah, we're having a good time, right? No two out of six characters are to complete. The rest are coming. I've seen the sneak peeks. Some of them look really, really cool. Well, they all look really cool, but you're going to be seeing them as they come out. So chess art traits we've got the chess pieces right we got the traits the family the material presidential i'm sorry pedestal with family name printed that's pretty cool the body the weapon the eyes the hair the background special accessory and class multiplier discord roles here's what it comes into play because i again i'm such a collector i'm a junkie for collecting things i gotta get those roles that's what i always aim for so og holder of the membership card og super collector hold all three rarities of membership card yes i will be chasing after those royalties i'm sorry roles by chess family right there you got all your roles shrine master full chess set of one family example a complete chaturanga set any materials so the first one we're minting here is is the passes and then we're going to be minting the actual nfts that you're going to be able to play chess with and they're going to be minting these chess boards there's only 450 of them these families they come into play uh, as you own an entire well let's just continue on don't listen to me just hear me read so full chess set of one family one material uh, example, a complete Chaturanga chess set on the same material. So if this doesn't make sense to you yet, it will as this project goes on. It really will. I'm not doing the justice I probably should do uh, to deserve to 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 understand what we're really doing here with this project. That's why we're going to be doing three parts. But for right now, just bear with me here, guys. Um, we've got... We've got multiple ways of really involving yourself in this project within the three different mints, building the families, uh, maximizing your your way of staking, earning these chess tokens, and being able to go out there and basically kick some butt and have a play to earn. Line your pockets. Let's go check it out. Chessverse. 
all are welcome to play. Free learn to play games. Uh, learn to play games. Play to earn variant of chai of chess game. Traditional chess. Standard chess games. Royal chess. Play the traditional game in a modern way. Special powers to boost your game. Special powers purchased from our marketplace. Now I know a little bit about these because I've talked it. Excuse me, guys. Dry throat today. It's very very hot here in Southern California. <clears throat> it's definitely affecting me, but. I'll do my best. I've talked to Johnny and Incognito, and what they're telling me, uh, how there's the obviously traditional chess, but there are going to be other ways of doing it. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to reveal that stuff yet, but I was like, okay, even if I never get into playing chess, this I'm going to get into. Earning these perks, finding, if I talk too much, I don't want to spoil anything, so I got to really watch myself, but we'll talk about that in the next video. It's really cool. It's very exciting, and you can purchase these things from the marketplace, and you can get these special boosts, and you can basically, like, foil your enemy's plans to take you out while you're formulating your own plans of taking them out and being the best you can. So the chess platform schedule a one of one a game with a member engine or anybody so i guess you can play against the computer you can play anybody you can find people you like to play with it's families friends your friends on discord whatever it may be uh select game mode and rent the chessboard under a chess family so if you have one of these chess boards which is a later mince you can rent these out that sounds pretty cool. Uh, start game by sending our native chess token. Rack up player ratings. A cure family-based points. Enter multiplayer mode for tournaments. Play, win, and earn chess currency. Percentage of each game will go back into the stake. NFT families. Yes, the roadmap. We pretty much have gone through that, but we got you know the art mint, the chess tokenomics, the airdrops, the staking platform. I mean, it goes on and it goes on and it goes on, and it's just not it doesn't run through 2023. That's just basically up until 2023 when this platform is built and all the integrations that I'm aware of that are coming, it's it's really going to be big, and I'm very excited about it. So the roadmap continued. Um, while chess verse platform development is underway, leverage chess.com platform. So yes, like I was saying, you can use chess.com until they actually build their, they're building in a whole, their own entire platform. And I believe they're going to be reaching out outside of the Cardano world to get more eyes on Cardano. That's another reason I was very excited about that. I'm trying to remember these points that I had in our conversation, which is now a couple weeks old, but um, they're going to be expanding out beyond that because chess is a global thing. It's a worldwide, everybody there. I mean, there's huge tournaments. I mean, almost like, People respect those grandmasters. You hear about this guy, oh, he's, you know, this this Russian guy or whatever. He was the chess grandmaster tournament champion of whatever it is, and people automatically respect that. So this is a global thing. NFTs are a global thing. The integration of being able to bring people to a platform that's built on Cardano and earn to play is really, really cool, and I think it's going to get really, really big. Again, just my own opinions. Always do your own research, but keep your eyes on this project. Keep your eyes on Ultimate CNT as we continue to reveal the stages of this project with the multi. Uh, with the multiple videos that I have going out and so I can explain more with what I know and not give away anything at the same time. It's really hard for me to do this, you guys. I mean, it's Let's just keep going. So enter the game by sending our native chess token to play, win, and earn upcoming mint, the membership card. So the supply, this is good information, 1,050. 50 these are allocated for the team and the giveaways. This is how I ended up with three for the channel for the tier three paid subscription membership members. Again, I do appreciate that. So I got three of these coming my way and I will be minting. I am on the whitelist. Price to be announced, which we already know is only 45 ADA. I, I like the fact that they made this first entry really, really easy. You know, um, they're using every bit of these funds. This isn't to, to pay the founders or the team or anything. They're literally using all of these funds to continue to develop the next stages of this project because it is a multi-stage project. Project, but I do know that from personal information, so I'm very excited to see them. You know, uh, give the community a chance to get in and an entry level at 45 ADA. Great freaking deal! I'm all about it. So. Here are the numbers. The gold membership card supply is 110. Mint up to five of the chess piece collections. That's really cool. I'm going to be chasing those golds. The silver, uh, there's 315 of those. You can mint three of them. And the bronze membership, there's 625. You can mint one of those. And again, if you collect all three, you get that special roll. And there's probably some perks attached to that as well. So the upcoming mint utilities OG status airdrop of the chess token guarantee of chess character mint whitelist for all future mints uh there's more than just the three that i'm talking about but we'll talk about those later boost the staking rewards alpha tester on the chess platform no rental fees for playing on our platform that's pretty cool that's a long-term hold right there discounted game fees in our chest first excuse me holder giveaways post mint 
Now the team, again, we've got Incognito. We went through all these folks, people who are here and part of this system, this uh, Cardano NFT ecosystem already, really, really knowledgeable, probably made friends along the way and decided to form and make this team a uh, very in-depth team to build exactly what they're building. So questions, yes, I'll bet you do have questions. In fact, I still have questions, which is why, again, we're gonna be breaking this down further and I can't wait to you know basically show you what I've minted and uh, how far this project has come between each stage. You can stay with me right here. I will give you those updates. If you have questions, listen, jump Jump on their Discord, get a hold of Incognito or Johnny Tran. Uh, these guys are, uh, first of all, personally, I'd just like to say to my two brothers, uh, you guys know who you are. I appreciate you. Uh, you, you guys, Incognito and Johnny Tran, wonderful people. Um, I've connected with them on a personal level now at this point, and I'm very excited about what they're doing. And um, Again, we have a lot in common. So, uh, you know, it's good to see good people doing good things. It's good to see good people reaching out there and achieving and striving for success and wanting to make this space a better place. So, yes, uh, I am personally invested. I'm also invested as a vet and an investor myself, and uh, I'm making good friends along the way. So, yeah, if you've got any questions, reach out to them. Let's get Incognito and Johnny on here for the interview so you can listen to them talk, more of them, less of me. But for right now, Royal Chess Club. Club. We're talking about an iceberg, guys. You got this much up top and you got all that underneath. So keep your eyes on Ultimate CNFT and Royal Chess Club. I got to go get this up, this uh, video updated and uploaded right now. And I've got to get back over to my mama. I've got to go help take care of my mama. She's still struggling. Hey, if you made it this far in the video, I really appreciate you. You are my true supporters. Pray for my mama. Uh, we're working on some some things that are really hard with our family, so forgive me if I seem a little bit distracted today. But I've got to get back over to my mom's house and uh, just uh, just be be the good, encouraging, loving, kind son that I have. And again, thank you to Incognito and Johnny for both keeping my mama in your prayers. I appreciate you guys, Mr. Ultimate. Out, peace and love. God bless.